Welcome back to Doki Doki Drawing. We're here with Sherbert, Kathy Cat, and Hinoi san. Sherbert, can you say hello? I am a magical creature from an alternate version of Earth called Lilacia. Sherbert to this! And next, Kathy Cat. Hey guys, it's the uh, YouTuber Kathy Cat today, dressed in magical girl style, because we're gonna do some cute stuff, so I'm excited. So, Hinoi san, Hinoi san, Hinoi san, Hinoi san, Hinoi san, Hinoi san, Today, the main challenge is we're going to be having a magical beast creature known as Sherbert draw themselves. Wait, what? <laughs> you're gonna draw you. You're gonna draw yourself. So, Hinoi san, what's the show about? So Sherbet, we'd like you to show us your amazing virtual drawing skills in VR chat. You'll be fine. Show us your tools here. You've got a canvas and pens. It looks like a drawing tablet stylus. I don't know how I'm supposed to draw with it, but <laughs> we, we can try. Do you want to draw the paintbrush or do you prefer the pen? I was going to mix the pen and the stylus. According to that, the paintbrush line limit is five. I can only draw five lines. Five lines of art is not good. Yeah, five lines is not even enough to draw Hello Kitty. I mean, if they're all lines are connected, sure. It'd look like an etch -a sketch The eyes might be a bit of a problem. <laughs> you could draw yeah. her wearing glasses. That might work. All right, Sherbert will now draw Sherbert. Okay, let's try. All right, we're seeing some round lines. That's not the color I want. Come on. I love how Sherbert has to tiptoe. Yeah, for everything. Let's bring it down here, there. Ah, you can just pull it down. Oh, we got colorful lines. How many times have you drawn yourself, Sherbert? You mean well or, or in, in total? <laughs> Both. Oh, many times. You can do it. Take it away. Am I getting any color out of this? Yeah, yeah. You got a, a pink eye. That is my eye color, not a, not a medical condition. Do you see other colors that we can't see because you have special monster powers? No. <laughs> it's not regular Sherbert vision. That looks so creepy. What am I doing? Please don't become an internet meme. This will this will make sense uh, when you've drawn the outline. I think. Problem is, I'm so short I can't like reach it. When you tiptoe. Okay. But my ears, they don't go that. I can't. We're gonna try. We're gonna try. Come on, ears. <laughs> 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 All right, those first ones weren't your ears, they were your horns. Okay. Cute, I can't even. They're working! Where the heck is the line? It you might be behind it. the canvas. What? That's not, that's not how canvases work! Well, this VR canvas is, uh, sp special. Yes, it sure is. Well, it's a good thing you guys can draw in real life. Oh, yeah, we got the benefit of the real pencil. I'm just gonna go for the second. <laughs> <laughs> you know, it's quite it's quite useful that that pen is quite long, isn't it? Oh, that looks horrible. There we go. Just a little bit of tuft in the... If I met that one in the middle of the night, I'm not quite sure if I would uh, pet it or run away screaming. Isn't there a little pocket-shaped, pocket-sized monster that looks a bit like this? You have to look at it straight on! This is the only way that it doesn't look completely creepy and menacing. I don't think this pen is accurate. Let's go with a brush. <laughs> but you've got to choose carefully, don't you? Because the brush can only be used five times, right? It needs to turn blue. It's kind of turning blue, but it like starts out purple. This is not how brushes work. Why is it purple on this side? Maybe the end of the line is always pink. It's a rainbow sherbet, like a dessert. I can't even draw the top of my head, I'm so short. Yeah, I'm really liking the, um, the Rik Taikan. Please humiliate me! I don't know if we can surpass this. This is, this is too good. Well, are you finished? I think so! Alright, congratulations! Thank you! Nice one! Our first drawing was in VR! The eyes are bigger than I was expecting, but I like them this way. They're kind of bug-like. Bug-like? In a good way, I like bugs. This is gonna be the next Lucky Charm serial character. Wait, what? Ja, Hinoe-san. Onegaishimasu. VR Sherbert wo minagara kaite itadakemasu ka? Sette to 3D da to to Ah, naruhodo. Sherbert, how did you feel when the first time you saw that you're gonna become an anime in the future? Oh my gosh. It was such an exciting experience to see myself just come to life in, in anime form. It was exciting! And and the manga? What's, uh, what do you like about the manga? I love the, the shoujo art style. Mochisagi Sensei has a, a beautiful art style. Well, it's like a softer uh, representation uh, of the characters. But I think that, that allows for more of the story to come through. Mm -hmm. To make the characters more relatable. What do you like so much about the story? Other than the fact it's my story, 
<laughs> difficult to really describe because it's a different take on, on Magical Girls in that it's sort of, it's a multiverse Magical Girls show. Really, between Erica and I, we're testing the bonds of our magical bonds of friendship against the entire universe! Absolutely. That's already really cute. I love how those <laughs> kind of rounded features already look so realistic. Ha! Ah. Maketa! Oh, this already looks so good. It's just like a few strokes. This already has so much realism. And you already kind of feel the, um, the taikan, like the uh, dimension of it. The depth of it, yeah, for sure. Definitely feels like it's not flat. It looks like it has shape. Yeah! The pose is adorable too. Mm. Interesting that the pose, it looks like it's, you know, it's it's very much thinking about the sort of movement that Sherbet was just doing in VR chat, kind of mm. show, showing us stuff like having a hand out and pointing at things. So Sherbet, for your anime, have you had a chance to like watch people doing the actual drawing or do you usually only see the like the finished result when it gets sent to you? Mm. I don't see the day to day, like the actual R drawing, but right. I see like... You know, I'll see the Ekonte mm. and um, the, you know, the uh, Sakuga. Right. Sometimes, you know, you can't send all the Sakuga to me. Of course, yeah, yeah. It's too much. But I, I do get to see the, the, the different elements and they come together. Because it's also important because if there's an error or a problem, you catch it before the animation is finished. It's less expensive to fix and easier <laughs> to fix. If you catch it after the animation, after the animation is already done, they have to go all the way back and fix it. Yeah, that's mm -hmm. going to be tougher for sure. Do people send ta sometimes send you fan art? Oh yeah, sometimes, like on, on uh, Twitter, I'll get uh, quite a bit. It's still super adorable. Kathy Cat also gets um, Kathy Cat fan art, obviously, because a lot of people watching her on YouTube. I'm very grateful for my fan art. I love it when people send me fan art so much. It's like the greatest gift. Oh, definitely. Sherbert, how about how, what's what's the most uh, surprising fan art you've received? I was at an event in uh, Aichi Prefecture. Okay. I asked for artwork from an artist that I really love, and she delivered the art to me on the last day of the event, and then said, "I, I love Sherbert. I want to draw you something else." And she drew this like huge piece of artwork for me, mm. and it's it's on my wall actually. So it's like one of my favorite pieces. Oh, that's wonderful. How did you yeah, transfer that back? Um, carefully. I don't remember <laughs> how I got it home, but I immediately went and had it framed. It, it's super adorable, and the artist now does, like, all of our, like, keychains. Wow, that's um, awesome. And there's a story behind it as well that makes it cool. How did you meet all of those wonderful people, Sherbert? Primarily, I mean, uh, on the internet. Uh, if I like their work, I reach out to them and do that, you know, Oshokai. If they reply, then, you know, see if they, we can do artwork together. Cool. What do you do then when you're not saving the world? Running around Tokyo, looking at everything. Because the human world is amazing. <laughs> the food, the people, the ninjas. And, the ninjas. Uh, <laughs> and the maids. And yeah, no, all of it. Sadly, we don't get to see the ninja aspect uh, day to day. Not day to day, but but you know, I got to I got to work with the, the ninja clan. Oh, that's right. Yeah, when you no, were doing um, a, a shoot for a video. That was a lot of fun. <laughs> Learn all about the philosophy and the religion and all the training that the ninja go through. Great. It's a lot. Thankfully, no one died. What is your special power? Dimensional hopping in the home of the uh, Jigenpion. 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 <laughs> That's so yes. cute. Yes, so I can go to different versions of, of our world or my world, and then I can use it to teleport to different areas. So Jigen I can go through Pion. one world to another here. Even if your power didn't do anything, it's got such a cool name. Yeah. Do you have a <laughs> special uh, weapon? So, I do. <laughs> I have a special weapon. Its name is Bop Maru. What does it oh, do? This side um, is like a pico pico hammer. Okay. You know, squeaks. So pop. This side delivers a big explosion. Oh. It, it says Dokan. <laughs> on the, what? You don't want to yeah. get that accidentally wrong then. No. <laughs> oh, don't worry. That happens a lot. So every magical creature has their own weapon. Basically, when the magical creature uh, from my world is born, uh, a piece of their soul is extracted and it's forged into their weapon. The weapon grows as the magical beast matures. Ah, okay. So I'm not fully mature yet, so my hammer is like, you know, just kind of halfway there. Can't wait to see what it looks like when it goes uh, legendary ultra level. Yeah! 
Super I hammer. I can be like my brother Gelato. He is the great hero of Lilatia. So it must be a little bit tough to stand in the shadow of such a famous brother. I want to be just like him someday. <laughs> Don't you want to be a little better? Is this treason? If I'm... <laughs> no! Is it no, treason? I, I'm sure he would love me anyway. <laughs> troops to do whatever needs to be done to save us you can do that and better we don't need to let it we've got sherbert <laughs> i'm your silver medal so look at this drawing it looks like we've got the the rough is all done the line art is done and hinoe has put in wow. it looks like highlights for the eyes shading wow. on the sides and we are just touching up i guess details on the nose little nostrils in there wow so much detail so fast <laughs> <laughs> Amazing. It looks like Sherbet should be saying something in this picture. Should we add a speech bubble? Well, I mean, there, there is the one slogan. This place, Can you give us a short version and then we'll write it in a speech bubble? Oh. <laughs> Should we do a quick comparison? Don't put the two together! There we go. No! <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> You have to write well, around 20 to 30 years of your life you have to draw. I don't think I live that long! Uh, Thanks, Sherbert and Hinoi, for drawing in this first challenge! There will be a second challenge coming up in the next video, so everyone look forward to that. Until the next video, we'll see you all around. Bye! Bye! Bye.